Oh, 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 I think that's evil and not. <laughs> hey, everybody, I'm the Maple Man. Welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome back to my Sims 4 gameplay challenge, The Asylum. Part 16. I can't believe it's part 16 already. And, you know, as much as it's an asylum, which is an old term, it's outdated, but keep in mind this is just a fun gameplay, nothing serious. <laughs> so, as much as, you know, like I said, it's an asylum, in the last part it felt more like a frat house. They had a hot tub and keg party, and they went to a country fair. So, they're having a pretty good life. I'm kind of jealous. I want to do all that stuff. <laughs> but anyway, in this part, I think a festival is coming up. I checked the calendar, and I think we are going to be going and enjoying uh, another festival. Um, I really wanted to get them out um, a bit more. And in the last part, we also ignored Zane's kind of girlfriend, Lilith. We kept ditching her. <laughs> So we owe her a real date. I think that's what I've said. Let's just hop right into the gameplay. If you have any questions, comments, or anything you'd like to say, feel free to leave them in the comment section. I do read comments, and when I can, I definitely try to reply. That's enough for me. Peace and love, everybody. Let's play. So it's the day after the party, and... <laughs> Everybody seems to be should have a good night's sleep considering I've let I did leave them the hot tub overnight, but we will sell it get rid of it um, Zane uh, got to bed um, I was actually surprised because he was hungry So I had to get him downstairs to get himself something to eat But nobody grabbed the bed because everybody was like sleeping in the hot tub, but People kept coming into his room like all night and putting their dirty dishes on this on his table. I'm like, that's kind of rude. But Zane is just about done sleeping here. He doesn't need any more sleep. I'm gonna get him up, I'm gonna get him to repair the sink, gonna get him to take a shower. And then I think he's, oh, what's going on here? He's very tense. Friend balance crashing. For Zane, there really is a sweet spot when it comes to friendship. Too few is bad, too many is also bad. This is getting out of hand. Zane really needs to figure out who he does and doesn't need in his life. Oh, we've all been there. Okay, so Zane just needs a shower. And um, I didn't get him to go out and do gardening, but one of the plants I could evolve. So I just sort of did that, and I didn't realize it brought us to the next level of his freelance botanist skill. So he just needs to get to level 6 gardening now at this level, or this step. Um, he's at level five. He needs to graft onto three plants, which I think we can do pretty quick, and fertilize five plants, which I think we can do pretty quick. So I think this this level will go pretty fast. I'm going to try to do as much of it maybe this morning as possible. Keep an eye on everybody. We'll get rid of the hot tub. And I believe we have a festival coming up today. So the goal is let's do a festival. We've had parties and we missed some festivals. But let's do one of them now. Hopefully, people clean up. And yeah, Erwin's been really weird all night. He was the main one bringing dirty dishes into Zane's bedroom and watching him sleep, which was really weird. But that's fine. That's fine. Okay, Zane, once you're done in the shower, I do want you to... Uh, you have to fertilize five plants. Let's do that real quick. Let's fertilize this one with, what do we have the most of here? Um, oh, I wanted to try um, planting this avocado. Let's see if we do that, but let's fertilize five things first. Get that out of the way. Um, I just don't want to lose too much here because I can't remember what exactly is planted. There's four and uh, four. Five. That, oh, then I guess he might as well harvest all. I'm going to get... Oh. Zane is far too tense. Oh, relax. Yeah, the place is messy. The gardening should relax you. Now, an avocado should be a tree, I think. Okay, well, let's get him relaxed, and then we'll finish the gardening. That should relax him a bit. And, yeah, he's fertilizing all the plants. Yeah, and his little points are going up here. 
what level is he for gardening now? I mean, I know he's level five, but how far in level five? 47%, okay. Kazane, are you able to do anything else? You're far too tense. Oh no. What about, can you do anything with these? No, it's just fertilize. Okay, what can he do to relieve his tenseness? It says read a book. Okay, this part's gonna be exciting. Um, there's no books in there. Do you have, there you go. Read Darley Porter and the Basement of Shadows. Uh, why don't you read that while you relax? What time is it? Oh, we still got an hour before we lock the doors. <gasps> yeah, that's it. Read to Devin. We never saw. Yeah. <laughs> what are you going on about? We never saw like one of the. Um, uh, okay, uh, we left a sugar skull offering, but we didn't see a sugar skull uh, dancer or person or something in the neighborhood, which was disappointing because it said somebody would show up. But honestly, I've never seen that in any of my gameplays. Maybe it was something from years ago that's no longer working. So I think what we'll do is we'll go into build mode, try to get Zane to relax. Like this doesn't have a time on it. Like. Why won't this disappear? Whereas everything else is really good. You know, from being around friends, feeling great, enjoying solitude. Okay, remembering sin in the past away, not so much. Oh my God, he's like wailing back here. Just read, relax. Yeah, I don't know how to get rid of this emo emoticon, which will really slow us down because I just wanted to get a bunch of the gardening done. <laughs> Because it's not just tense, it's very tense. Oh, write in a journal. Okay, let's, do we have a journal? Let's go into build mode. We'll get a journal, we'll get rid of the hot tub. We'll fix this. Yeah, I can see Jane, uh, Zane have, Jane. <laughs> Zane having a journal. Um, because it seems like something, oh, I'm sorry, Erwin. <laughs> You're just going to fall on the ground, aren't you? Let's find a journal. I can see, see Zane being a journal writer. Why not? Private journal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, in the pink. Hey, somebody cleaned up his room. Awesome. Okay, we'll buy one of these. There are only 28 simoleons. Oh, I should put it outside for him since he is just, you know, right there. He can write in his journal while talking to Devin. Okay, let's see if that will get rid of the emoticon because... Reading isn't quite doing it. Emoticon, I think that's what it's called. Um, rant about stress. Okay, maybe that'll do it. And then you can put that book back in your inventory. Bills have just been delivered. That would give us stress. Hey, we actually have enough this time. Okay, Zane, let's do this. And, okay, I gotta lock the doors too. Okay, once again, all the doors are locked. Some people are doing okay, some people not so great. Zane, is this, oh God, vent to someone. Okay, finish writing in your journal and then you can vent to Erwin, who put a whole bunch of dirty dishes in your ah, bedroom. Because I need you to de-stress so that we can do the gardening. This might not help. You're not exactly a guitar player. Okay, I got rid of the hot tub, I got rid of the keg. You guys can get out of your bathing suits because they're not that attractive. <laughs> oh, Zane, come on. Yeah, now he's getting stressed from frayed nerves from badly played music. Oh, okay, we got rid of some... Oh, good, we got rid of the stress. So, let's take care of the garden, which I've been meaning to do for the last uh, four sim hours. Let's harvest everything. Um, and then we'll work on splicing some of the plants. And then hopefully... It will be, um, what should I call it? Okay, so that garlic plant got evolved. And yeah, how is Zane doing? Oh my God, he's gotta run to the washroom. Okay, this is, this is interesting. Can we do anything else with this plant? No, just talk to it. Maybe we should talk to it, but okay, I'll get Zane to do this, run to the washroom, and then we'll get back to doing some serious gardening here. We got up a level. And up a level, there's probably only one more level after this. Okay, so I've Zane taking cuttings. I'm not sure why we can't splice anything together right now, but that's okay. <gasps> Our apple tree is dead. 
This plant does not need water. No kidding. Okay, let's see if we can plant then the avocado. Let's put the avocado back here. Let's plant it and see how it does. Oh my God, why are you so stressed again? Okay, well, you know, we took cuttings. I don't know if we can splice anything. Oh, there's more to harvest. Oh, graft! Graft onto the garlic plant. We will graft. He's far too tense to this. Zero Sim's first name. What? Oh, Patchy's up. That's what that noise was. Okay, he wants to chat with Patchy. Absolutely. Oh my god, he can do a whole bunch of stuff with Patchy now. Let's vent. Oh no. What's wrong? Share the rebate day spirit. It is rebate day, even though <laughs> I'm not sure what, that, what we need to do about that. Oh, and he did have a bit of a romance with, with uh, <laughs> Patchy, so why not keep it going? Oh, Zane, it's not going well. Your people skills are not doing so good. Oh, my God, everything's just going down. Oh, my God, no matter what we do today, it doesn't seem to work. No, <gasps> nothing. Oh, no. Oh, Patchy didn't like anything we said or did. You're hungry again. All right, all right, okay. There's got to be some food. There might not be, actually. <laughs> no, there's nothing. Oh, my God. Okay. We will uh, cook some food for everybody. Might as well cook a garden salad since we have a whole bunch of vegetables. Get that going. And then hopefully... Uh, okay, vegetable dumplings. That'll work. Oh, we got to pay bills, too. Zane is going to mourn Devin. Okay, enough. <laughs> we'll also get him to pay the bills. Everyone else seems to be doing just A-OK, -okay, except poor Irwin is exhausted, because I think he was the only one who didn't get much sleep. Patchy, is Patchy taking care of our plants? What is he doing? I just saw him. I don't know, he's coming in. What's he doing? Maybe we should have kept the hot tub for Patchy. Oh no, everybody's walking in on Estrella. Oh no. <laughs> Patchy, you just made a beeline to the bathroom for some reason, and I'm not sure why, other than to harass Estrella. Oh my god, come on, you can do this quick. Oh! Yeah, she's saying, don't be so crabby. Okay, come on, Zane, you're starving. Starving, starving, starving. Did you, did you plant the avocado, or did you get stuck? No, you planted it. Okay. So I think things are doing okay. Okay, can we can graft. <gasps> Plant shoot from a lily. Okay, I think he's past his stress. Okay, on the bell pepper, we're going to graft the lily. Oh, no, he's too stressed. It's not saying he's too stressed, but it's not letting us do it. Or maybe these ones don't graft together. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, we'll save that for the next part. I think we've done enough gardening. Oh, my God. Yeah, there's just... Ah, Zane is just far too tense. Okay, have your lunch. We got to get out of here. We got to do something. I'm not sure what to do with this emotion tile. Uh, too few is bad. Too many is bad. For friends, this is getting out of hand. Zane really needs to figure out who he does and doesn't need in his life. Yeah, that's fine, but <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Like go and tell people off or, oh, <gasps> Patchy's cleaning. Excellent. We still need a sink downstairs, but we're not going to worry about that today. Zane, how are you doing now? You are good. You are good. We're waiting for a festival to happen, but, oh my God, you're really not having a good day. No, oh, thank you, Patchy. Okay, so I did think of something else because they're allowed to have one sort of activity in the house. 
And of course, I forgot what it was. <laughs> um, no, no, it was. I'm going to go into build mode. I'm going to get it. Maybe they can try that out. Even though it might be a little too early for that because I think it'll be interesting in the night when some of them don't have bedrooms. But if I can get it out, maybe you'll see where we're going with it. Okay, perfect. There's our seance table. Um, and we'll just put whatever chairs we have around it. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We're only allowed four chairs. So maybe I'll just keep two at the seance table. And the rest can, uh, the other two can stay in the kitchen. What is Patchy all weird about now? Look at this face. Look at this face. Okay, anyway, back into play mode. I'll, we'll just see if anybody just hits the seance table for now. If not, that's fine. Uh, I don't know how to get rid of this thing here. Relax in a sauna. We, we don't have a sauna. Maybe Zane needs a spa day. Maybe that's what we'll do tomorrow. I think that's not a bad idea, but I'm gonna zip ahead until this festival, which is supposed to start, will start. Oh, here it is. Human hijinks festival is down. Click on any dynamic sign around town to find out more. Lilith Vitor is wondering if I want to go over to her house and hang out. Oh my God, why does this always happen where we have to like ditch Lilith? Oh well. Okay, let's travel to the Humor and Hijinks Festival. This is what I've been waiting for all day. <laughs> okay, let's bring the housemates. Lucian, Mia, Jerry, Erwin, Katie, Jesse, and Estrella. And I think that's all we can bring anyway. Um, can we bring Lilith? No, nope, you can only bring the household. Let's go. Okay, we are at the Humor and Hijinks Festival. Oh, and we're just gonna jump right in. Zane is confident. Some of the others are not in that great a state, but the Humor and Hijinks Festival just started. Let's drink some. Um, join the jokesters or join the pranksters? I think, uh, I think we'll join the pranksters this time, actually. Okay, so it should tell us what we need to do. Oh, it is a rebate day. <laughs> Jerry's joined the pranksters. Perform mischief interactions to gain points for your team. Okay, we gotta be mischievous, which is not Zane's, you know, forte. And that's kind of why I chose it. I, I don't think anything is really his forte when it comes to jokes or <laughs> mischief. Send a playful text. Okay, why don't we send a playful text to, uh, uh, send a playful text to, okay, Lilith isn't here. Uh, Herbert then. Oh, he's just enjoying the music. Oh, his tense thing is all, oh, that stupid one about too many friends is gone. Okay, now let's find somebody to perform mischief on. Oh, he's having a blast. Oh, let's get out and have some fun. Oh, Herbert. Um, accept and travel. No, 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 no. Park Hammond. Oh, I'm sorry, Herbert. We're already at the festival. If you want to come here, I'd say yes. Okay, this guy, um, who is he? Let's give him a friendly introduction. Is he a comedian? Uh, he's glowing. So he must be somewhat famous. So I'm not sure now if we'll be able to do mischievous stuff if he's a celebrity. Oh, imply tea sabotage. Sing the prankster theme song. Um, mischief. Oh, convince the tea is poisonous. Uh, mischief. What is it? Give a bizarre fruit. Yes. I want to see you give one of the bizarre fruit to this guy. Maybe he'll eat it. Zay, did you do this fart? <laughs> oh my god. I don't think Zayn likes mischief, but he does it well. Okay, so what is he doing? What is he doing? Oh, oh. <laughs> so is that mischief? Oh. <laughs> I think that's evil and not. <laughs> All right. So we've zombified somebody at the Hijinks and Humor Festival, which is fine. Just fine. I think it's within the rules. 
Okay, and we're enjoying the comedian. How's everybody else doing? Where is everybody else? Okay, they're hanging around this celebrity. And, um, yeah, everybody looks like they're doing okay. I mean, everybody's tired, of course. And, you know, we got a zombie now. <laughs> this is a great humor and hijinks festival. Okay, but Zane, we've got to, um, oh, oh, bye. <laughs> we got to find somebody else to be mischievous with. This is all of our people, pretty much. Um, what about her? Um, give her a friendly intro. Um, make a flirtatious joke. Oh, that, I guess you shouldn't do that. Flash your crazy eyes. Oh, Zane, you're so being out of character right now, and I'm loving it. The pranksters are in the lead by one. Keep performing interactions for your team to earn points. That's what we're doing. Yeah, he's explaining, you know, I gave that guy the bizarre fruit, then he just looked weird. Oh, she likes him. Convince her the tea is poisonous. Oh, what is he telling her now? Talking about aliens. I just think Zane is my favorite character of all time. <laughs> okay, are we winning? Are we winning? I mean, you've got to love your Sims. And I've played Zane in several gameplays because he is just... Been, I just think great. His interactions are just perfect. Like now he's just like mm, chilling out, listening to music. Here comes the zombie. <laughs> okay, I think we won. Okay, everybody's flirty with Zane for some reason. Oh my god, stop farting. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're having a blast. The pranksters are in the lead by four. Keep performing interactions. Okay, I thought we were. People are going home, I think. Where are you guys going? Mia? Lucian? You're just kind of wandering about. Okay, you're going into the museum. Okay, I'm not sure why, but you know what? That's fine if that's what you want to do. Maybe there's a bench you can sleep on. That's fine. Yeah, we're getting tired. You know. Oh, hey, another alien. Who's this? Derek. Brittany. Is this Herbert? Did Herbert show up? No, Gilbert. We know Gilbert. Oh, here. Go talk to um, Derek. Give Derek a friendly intro. Brittany. Brittany's like, she's, she must be advertising for this kiosk. She's like, it's the best food ever. Go meet another alien. We don't have enough alien friends in this. I was like, every, what? <laughs> oh, he doesn't like the celebrity. Yeah, like, go away. We're trying to talk to this guy. Derek. Yeah, everybody's tired. Okay. Well, it's just an hour to go till the fireworks go off. Oh, it's over. It's over. The fireworks are going off. All right. We got a voodoo doll, fireworks, and $500. Because we were the pranksters. So we won. So finally, I got to do a festival. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Should we just... Put this in our inventory? No, we don't own it. That's too bad. Oh, but everybody's enjoying the fireworks. Oh, Estrella's hydration is right down. So this is over. We're going to head home and hopefully we, uh, <laughs> Estrella gets in some water real quick. Maybe I should have kept the hot tub. Okay. Yay, Zane's reached level three of the mischief skill. Okay, so I'm going to zip ahead. We'll zip home, make sure everybody's okay, and play ahead. Okay. So we are home. Uh, I am going to play ahead. I'm just going to bring everybody back. Um, I'm going to unlock the doors, and hopefully Mia 
Uh, not Mia. Estrella like hops in the shower real quick. The shower isn't broken, is it? No, I'm not. I'm not playing her. Uh, but let's unlock the bedroom doors, and I'm just kind of playing a little bit to see. Oh, because now I'm really worried about Estrella. And it is winter, so hopefully everybody came in. Oh, there's Estrella there. She's going right to the shower. Oh, she is. Good girl. Okay, we almost lost our mermaid again. It can happen. Okay. Just to make sure nobody is just standing outside. Okay. But you're in your winter wear, Mia, so you should be okay, right? Yeah, but you want to go... What is this? Shades of sh Shade and Fraud. It can be a little gratifying to see someone suffer depending on the someone. Oh my God. I've never seen that before. And Zane, of course, you're mourning Devin. You're telling him about, you know, the great humor and hijinks festival. You know, can he, oh my God, he's got to use the washroom. Oh my God. Oh, you know what? We've learned something smart. Why don't you go use the washroom over here? And then maybe I'll quickly see if there's some gardening we can do. Cause he's just a little uncomfortable cause he's tired. But can we maybe graft some stuff on here? No, it's not letting us do it. And now, no, that's really strange. Ah, it's because he's still far too uncomfortable. All right, run to the washroom. Let's go. How's everybody else doing in the house? Okay, so I'm going to play ahead till tomorrow. I'm so happy we got a chance to do a festival. <gasps> Zane, Devin is here. Maybe I won't zip ahead. He's angry. Who's he talking to? Hurry up, Zane. Hurry up, Zane. Your friend is actually here. How far is this washroom? Okay, there you go. Okay, so I'm trying to play ahead till tomorrow, but I'm just finding this a little interesting that Zane is, uh, Zane, Devin is actually back. We haven't actually seen his ghost in a while and complain about problems. Oh, help him out. Help him out. Try to calm down. Help him out. Help him out. And then you can go to bed if there is a bed. Oh, I see like four people already asleep. Zane, you may have not gotten a bed because we got carried away with Devin. But that's okay. He's your best friend. Dizzy. Novi. Yeah, boo. Oh, no, he is mad. He's like, you guys left me out in the sun. You should know better. Oh, no. Every one of Zane's interactions with his friends Patchy and now Devin are not going well today. I don't know why. Oh, see, like, it's all, like, the friendship's going down, 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 and he's doing good things. So apologize. Help out. Maybe saying it's, like, none of your business. Okay, the friendship went up there. There we go. Now it's back on track. Come on, Devin. Who mourns you every day? Every day. Hey. Okay, walk away, Zane. Walk away. It's just not good. Is there a bed available? Did someone just open up a bed? No. No. Okay, well, it's part of the rules. Zane doesn't get a bed, so I'm gonna zip ahead until uh, we can play here. Or, oh my God, should we? Should we? I'm, I'm gonna see what we can do with this seance table first. Zane is too tired to do this right now. Commune with the departed, sense spiritual volatility. Well, we already did that with Devin. <laughs> I mean, there's no question. Okay, gonna zip ahead till tomorrow. Try to get a bit more of the gardening done. And if anything happens with Zane being so exhausted or the seance table or Devin talking to the goldfish, at least he likes the goldfish today. He's telling him a joke. Okay, well. You know, that's fine. Now he's going to go use the computer. Okay. I'm going to zip ahead till tomorrow morning. I think we have a little bit more time. Do a little bit of the gardening and just see where everything is at. 
So it is the next morning. Zane did not get a bed at all. He is exhausted, but he was able to graft onto uh, three plants. So I had him do his gardening behind the scenes. Um, but the interesting thing is, and I'm going to do it again, He's he can take a cutting from the bizarre fruit, which has grown, the bizarre plant, which has grown quite a bit. I had him graft onto one of these lilies, um, but I want to see how much he can graft I'm going to have him graft the bizarre fruit on a couple of things and just see what happens because I've never had him graft the bizarre fruit. I've never had anybody use the bizarre fruit as sort of a, <laughs> as like a gardening thing before. Um, did our, we did plant our avocado. So let's take care of the plants here. Um, just to see if any need watering or fertilizing or anything like that or harvesting, uh, harvest all. Uh, everything looks okay. Everything looks really good. Yeah, so I'll give them just a harvest. And um, unfortunately, I'm not sure what else we could do at this point. <laughs> um, I'm just going to see if any of the beds are open. Oh, there's only half an hour. Oh, my God. And then we got to lock all the beds and try to keep Zane at least alive a little bit. I was hoping we could do a bit of the communing with the spirits with the sands table, but no, not while Zane is this uncomfortable. Oh my God, he just he's just gonna keep passing out. So we'll just play a little bit till he stops passing out. He needs to reach gardening level six to get to the next level. The first level of this was so hard to do and yeah, he's at 90% of level five. So in the next part, he will finish uh, his gardening. Oh my God. <laughs> this level of the gardening aspiration or the freelance botanist aspiration because there's really not much for him to do. Once we started grafting, once it started working, it was fine. Yeah, you like gardening. Why don't you go inside? You're in your winter wear, so you are fine. But why don't you find somewhere inside to pass out? <laughs> and, oh, you want to go to bed, but I'm sorry. It's 9 o'clock. we got to get everybody out of the bedrooms. Oh, Zane is trying to sneak in. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. These are the rules. You've gotten to bed every night except last night. I'm sorry. Get out of that room. Doors are locked. So, uh, I don't know what he's going to do. I mean, we could go somewhere. Oh, Winterfest starts tomorrow. Okay, so we're going to be doing Winterfest and... <laughs> uh, Winterfest and a seance, I think, in the next part. I think I'll zip ahead a day. Um, I don't really want to take them anywhere while Zane is this exhausted. But I think in the next part, we'll do Winterfest. We'll do a seance. And, you know, unless... Maybe we go somewhere where he can sneak a nap. That might be good. Maybe we'll uh, go to a gym or something. But otherwise, I think we'll go and do Winterfest. Yeah, I think this is where we're going to have to end it because Zen is exhausted. <laughs> but I'm excited for the next part with Winterfest, a seance table. Just gonna have to make sure that Zane gets a bed or we take him somewhere where he can get some sleep. <laughs> but you know what? I had a blast with the Humor and Hijinks Festival. I think it was fantastic. Um, I had a lot of fun with this part. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, it might be a little short, but <laughs> it's the way some of them go. So till the next time, peace and love.